The Terex-2 stands as an amphibious armored personnel carrier engineered by Singaporean Technologies Kinetics in response to a requirement from the U.S. Marine Corps. This demand arose as a replacement for the aging LAV-25 series of armored vehicles. Collaborating with Science Applications International Corporation, SAIC, of the United States to penetrate the U.S. market, Singaporean Technologies Kinetics developed the Terex-2 as an enhanced iteration of the original Terex, boasting numerous improvements, particularly in its amphibious capabilities. Publicly unveiled in 2015, the Terex-2 showcased advancements aimed at meeting the stringent water speed and reserve buoyancy criteria set forth by the U.S. Marines. Distinguished by a specially shaped hull to optimize buoyancy and water speed, the Terex-2 integrates a double V-shaped hull design, offering enhanced protection against landmines and improvised explosive devices, a feature reminiscent of its predecessor. Versatility defines its armament options, ranging from a baseline configuration featuring a remotely controlled weapon station armed with a 12.7mm heavy machine gun to the possibility of heavier armaments like a two-man turret equipped with a 30mm cannon. Manning the Terex-2 is a crew of two, a driver and a vehicle commander, while accommodating up to 12 dismounts. Troop ingress and egress are facilitated through a rear ramp with integral doors, complemented by roof hatches for emergency exits. Boasting an all-round surveillance system for a 360 degrees view and a sophisticated navigation system, the vehicle's driver compartment offers customizable touchscreen interfaces. Powering the Terex-2 is a robust Caterpillar C9.3 turbocharged diesel engine generating 600 horsepower, with a Euro variant producing 525 horsepower. Paired with an Allison automatic transmission offering 6 forward and 1 reverse speeds, the vehicle's driveline incorporates all-wheel steering capability, ensuring exceptional maneuverability and a tight turning radius. Further enhancing mobility are features such as a central tire inflation system and run-flat tires, enabling operation even with one or more wheels damaged or destroyed. In aquatic environments, the Terex-2 relies on two water jets for propulsion, achieving a maximum amphibious speed of 11 km per hour and capable of operating under sea state 4 conditions. Deployment to operational theaters can be facilitated via transport aboard amphibious assault ships or airlifted by military cargo aircraft. The Terex-2 offers a range of proposed variants, including a baseline armored personnel carrier, a command vehicle, an engineer vehicle, and an armored ambulance, demonstrating its adaptability to diverse mission requirements.